How did I meet Beanie Man? Um, well, Beanie Man met me. <laughs> uh, long story, we're both, I mean, he's always liked me long before I knew who he was from me going out and mashing up the different dance, even before I was dance all queen. He's always, you know, been my, 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 my bigger sister, Pinky, who used to date Tiger. Hello, Lakara people. It's me, Tiger. So I was always in the music scene because of him. So Binum and I, and I come before we became an item. How we became an item, oh wow, that's a long story. But um, I think we were belonging then. I was in my uptown circle, but wanted to be a part of dance hall. And my fiance at the time was, I was bored. <laughs> and Binum came along and brought me back to my age group and show me where the real excitement and fun was. Zaga Zaga Zik, this magazine is sick. Cause when it comes to lyric, them money have it. When them write it and print it, people read it. This is being the man I'm talking about it. And you can see it on the DVD if you buy it. Or you go online and watch it. It's lyric magazine. Be clean. Go. Does being a man pay a role? I was already, in 1994, I was a household name. So at this point, I was now going to play a role in his career by introducing him and letting him open to a wider vast. At night, by 94, I was, I was on every commercial in Jamaica. I was on every radio station, every newspaper, every TV station. You couldn't, there is not a day pass that you wouldn't see me in the paper for something. So when Beanie Man came, it was just an additive to my life for me now being very happy and completed that it was now dance all and totally the queen, and you know, a queen makes a king, not the reverse. I know what you like, it's right here, come home and get it. Mm, come home, come get it. Aye, aye, aye. And so, Lyric Digital Magazine, come home, come get it. Boom. What do I think of his marriage to the angel? Um, I knew it wasn't going to last because of a long whole history. He came to me, won't go into that, asking me if, won't go into that. Let's just say that. But I knew it wouldn't last because it was probably too publicized. Um, they were trying too hard to prove they were in love. And so the pressure from the public, um, to themselves, I think that pressure, I don't, knowing Beanie Man, I knew he wouldn't be able to handle it, and I'm not sure of the angel, but I just know there was just too much of the public in, internalizing their private lives, and it came through, it didn't last. The reason for me and Beanie Man um, break up at that time, especially in 1992, the same thing that happened to him in 2000 and whatever, they got married, we were not, um, there was no privacy, although I didn't let them in my, my space, so they would only see the public, that is, the, the media. They would only see what I would take out. But um, we were two very young people, and at the time, stardom was in both of us way. And I didn't want to amper his, and I don't think he wanted to amper mine. But the love for each other was always there. <laughs> 